everyone, it's Blair here with Ocean View Home and Garden. And of course we have our best selling veggie varieties that we sell at the garden center, but we also have some really amazing underrated veggies that deserve some recognition and thought you guys should know. Our first underrated veggie variety is tomato sugar rush. Is it weird to call a veggie beautiful? Because just look at that, foliage is just gorgeous. And they definitely live up to their name. They boast huge long clusters of little cherry tomatoes that are really really sweet and add um, a really nice touch to your salads. They can grow up to seven feet tall so they do require some support and some staking and also a full sun location. The Jubilee tomato is an heirloom variety tomato with medium sized gorgeous bright yellow fruit has a mild flavor with few seeds and can grow up to seven feet tall in a full sun location. So it also will likely require some support and some staking. Another great cherry tomato variety, again, living up to its name is chocolate sprinkles. The fruit is red with green overlays, giving it a brown or chocolate sprinkles like appearance. The flavor is rich, but not overly sweet. They grow in clusters of five to seven tomatoes and can grow up to seven feet tall. So will also require some staking in a full sun location and will bear fruit all summer long. Dragon roll peppers are great for someone who likes a little bit of heat, but not too much, only reaching 200 on the Scoville scale. They bear fruit two months after planting and have a sweet, smoky flavor with that mild heat and only grow to about 18 inches tall. So they're great for container planting um, as long as it's getting six hours or more of sunlight. I hope you're enjoying this video. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel as well as follow us on our Instagram and Facebook pages at Ocean View Home and Garden. The Diva Cucumber has a sweet, not bitter flavor with a crisp texture. The fruit is picked at six to eight inches long and all the flowers on this plant are female, so it does not require pollination. This also means that it has minimal seeds, but make sure that you give this plant lots of space on a trellis or fence for it to climb. The Snackabell pepper is the best pepper for snacking, as you could probably tell from the name. They can be picked at all stages of ripeness, which is green, yellow, orange, or red. They are easy to clean. You just push down the stem cap and that will release the seeds. They have a sweet but rich flavor and grows two feet tall by two feet wide. So it's a great container plant in a full sun environment. Make sure you give these underrated veggies the recognition they deserve and plant some in your garden this year. It also gives you something different to talk about and share with your other gardening friends. Thank you guys so much for watching.